the jalapeno, a classic chili pepper, adding a spicy kick to any Taco Tuesday. Growing these picante delights is easy, so let's take a look at the process from seed all the way to harvest. Fill a seedling tray with high quality growing medium. It should contain lightweight ingredients such as peat moss, coco coir, perlite, and vermiculite. Toss a bottom tray under grow lights and fill with a half inch of water. The seedling tray will slowly wick up the water and become hydrated. Sow two seeds in shallow indents centered in each cell. Get misty. I like to plug in a temperature probe to measure soil warmth. Around 80 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit will get your jalapeno seedlings popping like it's nobody's business. A plastic dome on top will add humidity. A few weeks later, you should have a healthy batch of jalapeno seedlings. Use a timer to keep the lights on for 12 to 14 hours a day. Give them a drink when the mix starts to dry. Once the weather warms up, I repot the seedlings into cups and slowly expose them to the great outdoors. From my experience, jalapenos aren't too picky when it comes to soil. Just make sure it's nice and loose and contains some organic matter like compost. In this case, I soaked the root balls before planting to prevent them from drying out while I took my time getting a row of approximately 30 jalapeno plants in the ground. I didn't film it, but always water in well after planting. Jalapenos grow really well in containers too. Use a fluffy potting mix and add a balanced tomato and vegetable fertilizer to the planting hole. Always start with green, healthy seedlings that look like they have a promising future. Water in and get ready for the bucketfuls of fresh jalapenos that are going to come your way. I recommend hybrid varieties like El Jefe that are high producers. On my half acre farm, I mixed up a concoction of fertilizer that was high in phosphorus and potassium, applying this to each plant by hand a couple times at the beginning of the season. Luckily, it rained a lot that summer. You don't have to get this fancy though. Any store-bought vegetable fertilizer high in phosphorus and potassium applied at the rate on the box or bag works just as well. A couple months after planting, your jalapenos will have kicked out a solid crop of zesty pods. Jalapenos are hardy plants and are one of the easiest peppers to grow successfully. This was my first year growing them and just look at the ridiculous amount I got. Now you're ready for tacos or any dish that requires some spicy peppers. Jalapeno poppers, anyone? Hey, don't forget to give me a nice, juicy, picante like before you go. Let's say 1,000 and subscribe for more gardening tips and tricks. That would be pretty cool. Cheers and happy jalapeno harvesting.